What is going on guys? Today we are getting Sobey's boat out of storage. It is right there. The guy already got it out of the shed. He plowed us a path. Man, all we gotta do is hook up and go now. I just hope we can make it through the snow that we got. And um, we're gonna get the red rocket. And I think we are heading south, so stay tuned. And uh, there are big things to come. We got the boat, we are hooked up. Now it's time to uh, tackle the adventure of uh, getting it up this huge hill and hope there's no ice, cause that could be a pain. But next time you see me, we should be in uh, Missouri maybe. Guys, you see this behind me? Look at this. There is no snow. There is no snow. There's no ice. There's no nothing. There's just a little bit of water, must have rain. But there is no snow. There's open water. And we are in Missouri. So we are ready for this. We are ready. We got everything we need. We got the boat. We got our rods. We got our reels. We got our clothes. We got sleeping bags. We got pillows. We got blankets. We got food. We got everything that we could need. And we are an hour away. So no further ado let's get there huh let's get there all right let's go see you all righty guys the rain is passed we have decently clear skies, so we're gonna head out. It, uh, it it got pretty windy, but that ain't stopping us. First time with the long rods out this year, so let's catch some fish. I mean, even if we don't catch them, we're on the water, we're on open water, we're not on ice, we're not stuck in three feet of snow. Oh, it just doesn't get better than this. So stay tuned, and we'll see if we can uh, get a little twitch twitch pause going, maybe uh, throw a football jig. Maybe a shaky head, spinner bait, chatter bait. I mean, we're gonna throw the whole sink today at him, so stick with me. We will catch some fish. The motor fired right up. We got the units on. It's working. It's, it's working. working. And it's sunny out too. It's pretty cool. It's up. The plan has come together. Stay tuned. Alrighty guys, we made it back to the hotel. Didn't do much fishing today. We just kind of got a lay of the land and how everything kind of was going on, all the conditions. And we got some venison steaks and ooh, I'm hungry, let's eat. Alrighty guys, started day two. Just went and got some Zaw from Casey's. Filled up the boat, topped it off. We're trying a different side of the lake today. I think we're gonna go to the north side. Yesterday we were on the south end of the lake and. It was just super muddy water and I don't, know, I don't know. We didn't really fish too much, but we just were looking around, seeing what we could find. And today we got some intel from, uh, from a guy that we know. And he, uh, he told us to come up by uh, the north end where he's from and check it out. So that's what we're gonna do. Stick with us, hopefully we catch some fish today. I'll turn it back on. What you ripping? A little jerk bait or what? Oh yeah, it don't matter.
no one else was around. And we still didn't catch anything today, so there's always tomorrow. Stay tuned. Alrighty guys, we just pulled off the water. It's dark out. We caught one fish today and it was a drum and so we caught it. So we probably covered three, four miles of water today and we didn't get a bite, a bass bite. Like, this is tough. This is a grind. This is one of the hardest bites I've ever been on, but we're going to keep after it. I mean, we still got high hopes. We're on open water. We got the Red Ranger just ripping. Now it's just time to catch the fish. We just got to, it seems like everywhere we go, there could be, you know, potentially a big fish or fish in general and we just haven't caught nothing. So we're going to change it up, go back to the hotel right now. Re I'm going to retie every single rod and because um, what we're throwing right now isn't, isn't working. But thank you guys so much for staying tuned and hopefully tomorrow I'll catch them a little better.